The first dog of California is sharing the limelight and perhaps even his food bowl as Governor Jerry Brown introduces a new pup in his family. Calusa Lucy Brown now joins big brother Sutter Brown at the Capitol. The two-month-old was introduced on Sutter's Twitter page this morning and new tonight, CBS 13's Adrian Moore with how corgi lovers across the state are celebrating the stardom surrounding the short-legged breed. They may fly low, but they're not short-sighted when it comes to politics. What do you think about those mandatory water cuts? He's not too happy about that. And this tweet left many howling. The governor's first Welsh corgi, Sutter Brown, barked up a buzz with the introduction of his deputy dog sister, Calusa Lucy Brown. I think that since corgis are herding dogs, that he'll be able to get a handle on the legislature a lot better because they'll be sending them in the right direction. Tim Matisson has been breeding the fox-like dogs for nearly 50 years and says the addition is a win for the breed and the state. The corgis are like potato chips. You know, if you have one corgi, you can't just have one corgi. Sometimes you have two. And according to longtime owners, there may be one big reason leaders like the governor and the queen keep calm and corgi on with these Olympic quality shedders. They usually agree with everything you say, and I think probably the governor appreciates that. So what doggy duties can we expect Lucy to take on? Well, her big brother's Facebook page might provide a few hints. There's helping with the state of the state, conservation efforts, committee meetings, and lobbying for a few belly rubs. Yeah, good. Check it out. Yes, that's a good girl. And while life in office may prove to be rough at times, Lucy has already locked in a positive boost to morale. If you have a corgi, you usually always have a corgi. She is cute. The governor's office says that Lucy was born in Red Bluff in March. She's a Border Collie Pembroke Welsh Corgi mix, which is commonly called a Borgie.